Hi, my name is Chris Lingle. I'm the Vice President of Marketing for Best Day Ever. Since 9-11, over 12,000 babies have died. A disproportionate number were Afro-American. An even greater number were from low-income households. Most were between the ages of one and six months. Best Day Ever, along with the No More Sids Foundation, believes that none of these 12,000 deaths had to happen. We believe this is 100% preventable. Sids is not a syndrome. Its solution is simple, effective, and affordable. The mission of Best Day Ever is to dedicate itself to the eradication of SIDS. With your help, the lives of over 2,000 infants a year can be saved. We can make a difference. On average, six infants die every day from SIDS in the U.S. It's the leading cause of death among babies after one month of age. SIDS is a developed country's epidemic. Research shows that it does not exist in underdeveloped countries where Western-style synthetic mattresses are not prevalent. SIDS is a post-World War II epidemic that coincides with the introduction of PVC to the construction of crib mattresses in the early 1950s. PVC contains chemical compounds of arsenic, antimony, and phosphorus. These three elements can be changed into gaseous forms that are highly toxic nerve agents when converted by common household mold and mildew. The gases created from phosphorus, antimony, and arsenic are 100 times more lethal than hydrogen cyanide and 1,000 times more deadly than carbon monoxide. Daycare centers have a death rate that is nearly seven times greater than the national average. In 1999, out of 13 SIDS deaths in San Diego, seven occurred in daycare centers. Before 1995, New Zealand suffered from the highest SIDS death rate of any country in the world. New Zealand has since experienced a decline of SIDS by nearly 80%. Why? Since the discovery of the toxic link by Dr. Barry Richardson in the UK, New Zealand has adopted a protocol of wrapping their mattresses in a gas impermeable cover. New Zealand mandates that all crib mattresses and daycare centers be wrapped in a gas impermeable cover. Since that mandate over 10 years ago, no daycare center has lost an infant to SIDS. In over 10 years since the mattress wrapping protocol was developed, an estimated 700,000 infants in 30 countries have slept on wrapped mattresses. There has not been one reported death on a properly wrapped mattress. Best Day Ever is on a mission. We would like to wrap 1 million mattresses in 2010. To do that, for every cover you buy, we will donate a cover to the No More Sids Foundation. Donate a cover, and best day ever, we'll donate a second cover to the No More Sids Foundation.